Hey, welcome back to Dake. Let me introduce you this morning to an honest little saw. This is our 712 model, seven inch round, 12 inch on the flat. We also have a bigger version of this called our 912. They, they basically got the same features, the 912 is just a little bit larger. Now you'll notice on this motor here, this is a great big motor, cast, uh, cast heat fins on it. It's got a thermal overload reset. This saw, we put these electronics on it to make it handy for you all to use. It's got a flood coolant switch up here, so you can either run it wet or dry. You turn it on, you turn it off, you got an e-stop over here available in case you have to shut her down in the middle of a cut or something. It's got this cylinder here which controls your downfeed rate. Little valve on the top, speeds are up, slows are down as you're cutting through your material. You'll also notice it's got a limit switch over on the other side, so while you're fabbing or welding or doing something else, the saw could be working for you. Hits that limit switch, shuts itself off. The saw is also available to configure in the vertical mode. Comes with a plate here in the back. And you just bolt this thing on down right here. And once your head is all the way up vertical, you use it like you would in normal vertical bandsaw cut profiles or whatnot. This has got a three horse motor on it, three quarter inch blade. You'll notice all the saws that we ship out of here at Dake come with an American made. You get a jug of coolant concentrate, which allows you to mix this up in a 10 to 1 ratio and pour into the reservoir in the back for flood coolant. This saw is not a lightweight machine. It weighs 400 pounds. And for the price of this saw, if you figured the weight to the list price, you're paying about 450 a pound for it. You can't even buy a pound of ground beef for that anymore. So we tried to think of a lot of things to put into a machine to make you an honest little saw that you could use for the rest of your life. This is it.